It is June 27th and I'm out here on a very small stream in the southern tier of New York and I was hoping with last night's rain, I think we got at least a quarter half an inch of rain that the streams would have come up and I could target some of the bigger brown trout that inhabit this stream but other than a little bit of stain to the water, um, the water levels are still super low. I've yet to get a brown of any size this season out of here so I was hoping this was the day, it still might be. I am gonna try some streamers with the water being a little bit stained. We'll see what we get. There we go. Came right out from under the log. That was cool. So I've been fishing this little pool here. I went through it with a very small woolly bugger. With several casts, didn't get anything. Most of these pools will have a couple, few brook trout in them. So I figured possibly there'd be a bigger trout in here chasing out or eating the other small trout. So I tried, tied on a much bigger conehead bugger dredged it through a couple times and uh, got a pretty good flash from what looked to be a good fish. Oh yeah, oh there's a big fish. So I kind of went back down to a muddler, try a different color. Maybe he wants a little crayfish color or maybe a streamer. You know what I'm gonna fish is a muddler. Muddler with a little white marabou in it. I'd eat it and uh, Got another good chase up in the top left. Oh, there he is. So I gave it a couple minutes here to rest. And now I've gone with a tan and brown bugger, smaller, kind of a crayfish color. There he is. Oh, he hit it too. Oh, oh, that looked like a different fish. That looked like a smaller fish. So my setup is super simple, fishing a woolly bugger, small woolly bugger, six feet of leader, 3x tippet, and today I'm fishing my um, seven and a half foot three weight, it's a Cabela's rod, it's called the cinch. There we go. That's a nice fish. Looks like a nice brookie. Ah, oh, that's a nice brookie. Gorgeous fish, look at that. I've just been chilling out here for five or ten minutes. 
I just saw three decent trout. First one came up and chased my, my woolly bugger. Ooh, that's a good fish. Look like a brown trout. Next cast, a smaller trout, maybe 10, 12 inches. Look like a brookie came out, chased it. See if he'll chase it again. There, ooh, that was a different fish. And then on my last cast, or it was the tail end of that cast, I saw what looked to be 16, 18 inch fish. Oh, come on. Come on. Oh, there's a huge trout. Huge trout just chased it. Wow. Either way, I think I'm gonna catch something good out of this spot, but we'll see. Okay, here we go. Come on, baby. Come on. There he is. Oh, man. I knew he was going to come after it. That is a decent fish. Man. Oh, there he is. Oh, he came after it. Man. Oh, man. He looked, he hit it again. He just flashed it. I'm going for a different tactic here. So I'm going to go for a big old dry fly with a big nymph on it. Because this fish is going to wise up pretty quick here. Just don't get many opportunities like this on this stream. Where I can, he can't see me. I'm on a high bank. I'm going to put a stimulator on. And just drop something big and juicy off of it and I bet he'll eat that Whew. hands shaking this is why I love fishing man this is what it's all about all right what would he want something big something big and juicy prince nymph it's tried and true it's flashy my hands are actually shaking slightly. <laughs> Stimulator. Prince Nymph. There. That's not the huge one, but that's a good fish. I'm happy with this guy. I'm gonna bring him upstream so I don't spook that other fish. Oh wow, this is a big brook trout. Oh boy, don't lose him, don't lose him. Oh wow, nice. Nice big brookie. Wow. That is awesome. Holy moly. Look at this guy. Drop him. Oh, I dropped him. <laughs> uh, it's all right. Dang, that was a big brook trout. Sweet. Kind of wanted to get a pick with him, but it's all right, it's all right. Okay, it is June 28th. I'm back at the stream I was fishing yesterday. Yesterday I was out 
after some rains to chase some brook trout and hopefully some larger trout in a small stream. It was partially successful. I did catch some brookies, but I and I moved. Um, I moved at least two larger fish, one of which looked to be a brown trout in the 16 to 18 inch range, which is is pretty rare in this in this stream. I have seen these fish. I'm aware that they're in the stream. I've chased them, I've spooked them. I've caught a couple of smaller ones, but yesterday I had a really good shot at them. So today I'm back. It's early morning and we just got a really heavy thunderstorm as I was driving up. So that should help things. I don't think we got a lot out of it, maybe a quarter of an inch. So it should add just a little bit of flow to the river, a little bit of color. And I'm gonna be heading back to the first pool where I hooked briefly a, a fairly large fish, nothing like the, the real big guy I saw at the end, but I've walked up, I don't know, maybe three quarters of a mile from my truck and I'm gonna hit this pool and then kind of jump my way back downstream to where I saw that big guy and uh, hopefully at least see him again and maybe even hook him. I'm pretty excited. I was thinking of that fish most of the night, so we'll see how today goes. So spot one uh, looks like a strikeout. Pulled a couple different streamers through there several times. Uh, didn't see a thing. The water's definitely a little cloudier today, which shouldn't hurt, but um, either that fish is just not feeding or moved out of this pool. Kind of unlikely. I mean, the water's so low, but um, I'm going to head back down to the other pool where that big guy was. There we go. Yeah, <laughs> just turned my other camera off. Well, went back into that pool where yesterday I saw at least two trout. I don't think I caught one out of that pool. I had a larger fish roll, strike my streamer, and then I saw another one chase it. Um, I did catch that nice brown. Like for this stream, that's a great fish. I mean, you know, a lot of the browns you catch are six, you know, six inches. They're, you know, little wild browns, but that guy was 
probably a solid 12 inches i didn't measure them or anything but good fish um don't catch a ton of them so so pretty successful didn't get the big one but i got the other pool which is which is a much better prospect so still got hope that i'm going to pull it off we'll see Nice, nice brook trout, man. That's a solid brookie. Well, I'm back at the spot where I had the encounter yesterday with that big fish. Caught a nice brookie here, but moved two fish. One was big. I mean, I'm guessing 16, 18 inches. I've probably said that like 10 times. Um, and then the other fish was 12, 14 kind of range. So really hoping I can hook this big fish. I've been trying to catch a big trout all season on this stream and uh, this would certainly make my day. So we'll see. I'm just gonna fish a black bugger, pretty simple. Let me check my line. My knot looks good. I've got two X tippet on. Should be more than enough here. And yesterday, the trout are, were all hanging out where this side channel enters. The water in that channel is slightly warmer than the main stem, which I didn't check today, but it's probably in the 50s. It's cold. That water coming out is probably around 60, so a little more comfortable, especially for a brown. go on the first cast. Camera fell over. Plan B today, we're gonna go with a big yellow stone. Um, I have seen some stone flies coming off from here, some big ones, so.
Obviously, I don't know if that fish is still in this spot. I feel like he's got to be there, but I would have thought he'd chase a streamer. At least chase it. Because I didn't hook him yesterday. He looked at it. He chased it, but I never hooked him, so. There we go. That's a good cast. Try black stonefly nymph. A little to the right. Here we go. Oh, 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 that was him. Oh, oh, he ate it. Dang it. Oh, there we go. There we go. That's a good fish. That's a good fish. You need that monster, but he's a good one. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. I think this is a trophy brookie. Holy mackerel! <laughs> that is a huge brook trout. Absolutely huge. Wow. That was 